Leon Smith, my nickname's Alfie. I'm the uh, fleet manager for Tasmania Fire Service. We've got 30 NPSs previously in our fleet. That's been very successful. The opportunity arose with Isuzu Australia to do a joint project to integrate some new technology onto that platform that was already tried and proven. It's a seven and a half ton GVM. We will establish, I guess, a functional or performance role first. We'll determine as an organisation what sort of capability we'd actually like to build, how we're going to use it in operations, and consider our previous experiences with the capability of the NPS. That's how it naturally worked out. We're already very well versed in the vehicle's abilities off-road in the off-road application. They're actually capable of operation in terrain where traditionally we perceive the Toyota Land Cruiser light tanker was probably the only type of vehicle. We've got a really good off-road performance. It's very, very capable. It has a big role in urban operations as well, very successfully. This is the first time we've actually built on a seven and a half tonner and it's allowed us to actually increase the amount of water on the vehicle, which is obviously very important and the performance that we've seen today with that increase in water volume uh, and increase in mass, given some of the new technology, you know, it's no surprise it's done everything we expected it would. We've been doing some extensive work in the development of compressed air foam or CAFs, and we knew with confidence that we'd be able to sort of integrate the same technology onto the NPS. The NPS has allowed us to integrate new air compressor technology being run off the actual NPS platform off the crankshaft to be able to once again enhance our traditional firefighting capability by basically bringing compressed air foam really easily into our traditional designer vehicle. This package in the NPS, uh, my understanding is it's one of the first into the industry at 7.5 tonne, but also with a significant value out of the airbags and also ABS system. I've got no doubt that we've just validated everything we thought in regard to the configuration of this truck, some of which is actually groundbreaking in the industry.